Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, we are going to discuss how we can use OVS on Windows 10. So that being said, let's get started. So to use OVS on our Windows 10 computer, first of all, we have to install the OVS software. For that, open your favorite browser and search for OVS. Let me tell you that OVS stands for Open Broadcast Software. It is a free and open source platform. You can use OVS to stream and record your computer screen. So to download, just open the link from ovsproject.com. Don't worry about the download link. The download link will be on the description box. So OVS is available for all the major operating systems. In this video, we are going to discuss how we can use OVS on Windows 10. For that, we are just going to download the Windows version of OVS. Here you can see it is downloading and it is around 71 MB. So it will take some time to download. So let me complete the download process. And after that, I will show you how you can use OVS on your Windows 10 computer. After the download has been completed, just install the software as you install all the Windows software. This is the interface of OVS software. So let me maximize the window. So here we have an option for scene. So here we can add our scene. So let me add one scene. Say for example, desktop and just click on OK. So here you can see here we have two scene. One is scene and another one is desktop. If you want to add another scene, then simply click on this plus icon or if you want to delete any scene from this scenes option, simply click on this minus option and here simply click on yes. So desktop is our scene. For this scene, we have to add a source. For that, simply click on this plus icon and here you can choose different source. You can capture your games, you can capture your display and you also have other capture option. For now, let me capture the display. For that, simply click on capture display and here you can name your source. So let me keep it default and make sure you check this box, make source visible and click on OK. And here you have to select a display. So if you have multiple display setup, then from the drop down menu, you can select the display. Right now, I only have one display. That's why I hit display one and here you will get the display resolution. And here simply check the box capture crosser then click on ok so here you can see here it is easily capturing the desktop screen so whatever i will do on my desktop screen will be captured by this software now if you want to add another source to this scene then you can simply click on this plus icon and from here just select your capture option and name your capture then click on ok now if you want to delete some source simply select that source and click on this minus option and here simply click on yes now here we have our audio mixer from here you can select your desktop audio and your microphone audio so here you can see the level of your desktop audio and here you can see the level of your microphone now if you click on the setting option here you will find a property under this property you can select your device from where you want to capture the desktop audio so here i have two option one is my monitor and another one is the speaker which I had connected to my computer and similarly for microphone also you get same option just click on property and from the drop down menu you can select the microphone and here we have other options start streaming start recording studio mode setting and exit so let me show you the studio mode so this is the studio mode here you can preview what you are recording and here you can manage the program and here we have the setting options so under general setting you can select your language themes from here you can simply select your theme output option and here we have the source option projectors and system trial and under this stream option you can select your stream service say for example you want to stream your game on youtube then you can simply select on youtube and youtube gaming and here you can select your server and here you have to paste your stream key you will get the stream key from your service provider and when we talk about output here are different types of output option here you can select simple and advanced this is the output option for streaming and this is the output option for recording from here you can change video bit rates encoder and audio bit rate if you want to change the output settings of recording so here we have the options this is the default part where your recording should be saved and here we have the quality same as the stream or you can select high quality 
or you can select lossless quality and here we have the recording format you can select mp4 mkv mov and more similarly here we have audio option so from here you can select sample bitrate channels you can select desktop audio and other audio settings and when we talk about video resolution so here we have the canvas resolution which is the default resolution that is 1920 by 1080 and here we have the output resolution so i will suggest you to keep output resolution and base resolution to the highest and here you can select fps value from here you can select your frame rates and when it comes to hotkey here you can assign some shortcuts and here are some advanced settings if you want to make some changes you can make here and after that simply click on apply then click on ok and here we have the file options edit option view option profile option scene collection tools and help now if you want to start the recording then simply click on start recording and here you can see it will capture every moment on your screen now to stop simply click on stop recording and it will save the recorded file to the default location which we had changed on the setting option so this way you can use OBS on your windows computer so that's it for this video hope this video was helpful to you if you find this video helpful don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this bye for now see you next video